Hello, I'm Dr. Frederick B. Covington, and I'm an occupational therapist. Welcome to AxVOT. Today we'll be discussing visual motor integration. Now, the technical or the medical definition of this is, visual motor integration refers to the ability to coordinate visual information with motor output for precise visual guidance of movement. It is the ability to coordinate visual information with motor output. Now, let's simplify this. What does all that mean? Here's the breakdown. A good example would be that the body is not precisely or accurately doing what the brain is telling it to do at the given moment that the brain is telling it to do it. Individuals with weak visual motor skills know what they want to do and how to do it, but they can't guide their body movement to complete the task. Visual motor integration is the underlying components of catching a ball, forming letters properly, and cutting on lines. Deficits in visual motor control arise from several different reasons. Some may not visually attend to the environment. Others may have difficulty controlling movement or processing visual information. And still others may be challenged when coordinating visual input with motor output. Now let's take an example. The whistle blew for physical education class. Today's game is kickball. Charles, who is a student at the school, began to feel anxious because he was always the last person to be picked for teams. Now Charles has a lot of difficulty when kicking the ball and catching the ball when it's his turn. It was as if he just couldn't get the timing right of when to kick the ball when he saw it rolling toward him, nor when to outstretch his arms when the ball flew through the air toward him. When he would see the ball coming, he would always kick too early and miss it or outreach his arms too slowly when attempting to catch it. This visual motor integration problem arises from Charles' brain, which has incorrectly recorded or processed the visual information and has misinformed the muscles he is using to kick and catch the ball. Now, there are various symptoms that may indicate a problem with visual motor integration, and some of them are having difficulty placing letters on lines, having difficulty cutting on lines with scissors, having difficulties performing fine motor tasks, and difficulty completing mazes, not being able to stay within the boundaries of the maze, and also what appears to be awkwardness in sporting and other physical activities. Now if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to send emails, or leave your comments here. And we'll be seeing you next time. Take care.